Welcome everybody to the seasonal diet, eating what our ancestors ate when they ate it like we were evolved to do. Welcome back to the second video of Berry Week. So this week we're speaking about berries because they are mostly in season now in the late spring to the summer. But we can split this up into two types of berries. The berries that are in season in the early summer versus the berries that are in season in the late summer. This video here is about the ones in the early summer that are in season now because most berries are in prime season for only one to two months and we have to make the most of them while they are here just like our ancestors would have done. First, strawberries and raspberries. Those are pretty easy. They're in season from May until July or even earlier depending on where you are from in the world. Um, probably these are the most common ones that you will find in your local grocery stores but ideally you could find them wild and you know there is a real big difference between the genetically modified you know poisoned ones you will find in the grocery store and the natural wild berries you can forage a wild strawberry is tiny for example but it has much more nutrients uh, pound for pound than the store-bought strawberries blueberries actually they're in season now but they can actually be in season from the spring all the way until the fall quite a long time and these um, are usually found in the cooler and even mountainous areas uh, of the world Black currants are another great one, my favorite actually this time of year, I call it Sulbad in Norway. Um, they tend to ripen in July, um, but some of the later varieties will fruit into August, um, and a few very early varieties might come in to be ripe in late June, where we are now. Gooseberries, uh, they are in season from May through August, but they're at their peak in July, so coming right up there and very good. I see those at the farmer's markets just here. Blackberries available uh, May until September, so they're available for a pretty long time, but their peak season is in June and July. The European cranberry uh, is in its peak season in June. And whereas the more, um, uh, whereas the American cranberry is actually in season in the late summer and fall, actually. Mulberries are in season very early from April till May. Saskatoon berries, uh, they're fruits that are harvested usually from mid June until late July. Red currants, like black currants, they're in season now, except they are more tart and uh, sour. Dewberries are a very early fruit too. They begin to fruit near the uh, beginning of April and usually finish near the middle or end of May. So those are the main ones. Not all native to Europe like I mentioned, but at least they're in the same family as some other ones native to Europe and they're from a similar climate. And they're all great options to have around this time. Some of them are going to be a lot easier to find in your local grocery store than others. I'll be honest, I'm all about the strawberries, raspberries, and blackberries around this time. Those are easy to find and they're my favorites. Uh, I love the others too, but it's just not that easy to get them. I, I'm in the middle of Los Angeles now and I can't go out and forage them <laughs> and they're actually hard to find in stores and but even you know when I'm back in Norway living very close to the woods where you can forage a lot of these things our modern lives just get too busy don't they the same would have happened in ancient times too except in ancient times the men would have maybe been too busy to go out and pick berries but they'd be hunting and working but the elderly or the children would actually make themselves useful <laughs> in ancient times and they'd be picking out the berries at this time of year instead of wasting their time in school and playing video games like kids do today in the summertime. So if you have a wonderful grandmother like I do or have kids that live in a safe enough place to send them out picking berries in this season then great. If not then yeah we still can try to get as many of these berries in our diets uh, as we can from the store or farmers markets. Uh, it's not ideal but it's about as good as we can get for now. Let us know in the comments. Do you have any of these bears in your store? We would love to hear. That's all for today though.